Hi, my name is Mia and I'm a curator at Flipboard. In this video, we'll talk about how you can collect anything from the web into a Flipboard magazine. To start using our web-based tools, go to Flipboard.com and then Web Tools. Drag the Flip It button to your browser bar. Then, anytime you see a web page you'd like to add to your magazine, simply click the Flip It button. Log in using your Flipboard username and password, and then add it to a new magazine or to one that already exists. You can also add a comment before sharing. Then go to editor.flipboard.com to manage your magazines. This is where you can get an overview of your readership and your curated content. Click on the pencil to edit your profile. Drag your magazines here to change their order on your profile. You can also share, edit, or delete magazines from this page. Click on a magazine to get a closer view of what's in it. You can drag and drop items to change their order on Flipboard, and you can see item level interactions here, like the number of likes, comments, and shares for a particular item. You can set the cover by clicking this icon, or delete individual items by clicking the trash can. Up here you can see your magazine's metrics, like number of readers, page slips, and number of articles. And here you can share, edit its details, reset the cover to the most recent item added, or delete the magazine. For best results, we recommend that you use Flipboard and the web to make and manage magazines. The web is particularly helpful when you're looking for something specific, while Flipboard is especially great for browsing. Either way, the end result is the same, a beautiful magazine around a subject you care about.